Welcome to Jikoni Magic's Meza. Today we are making spaghetti stir fry. It's a quick and easy dish to whip up and most if not all of the ingredients that I'm going to use are already in your pantry. Plus it's an interesting way of making use of your leftover spaghetti. The way that I usually prepare my beef in order to end up with really thin slices is that I freeze it till it's almost solid but not really rock hard. Eh? So this ends up firming up the meat and the knife can go through with ease. As you can see this slice of beef is nicely thin and very good for stir fry. So to just further demonstrate how thin they come out, you can see how thinly I was able to slice my beef, okay? And then I put all this thinly sliced beef into a bowl, let it soak completely and come to room temperature, and then I marinated. So I did this by adding apple cider vinegar, light soy sauce, cornstarch, and ginger and garlic that were finely minced. Then I mixed everything together and I realized that I had forgotten to add salt. So I just added enough to taste, mixed everything together and then set it aside for about 20 minutes for the flavors to all come together and be one happy family. And as that was going on, I prepared my vegetables. These are my spring onions, the white part. And this is the green part of the spring onions, my carrots. And this is a bunch of spinach leaves. It was about that much. Then my red, yellow and green hohos. And these are my thinly sliced onions. Ginger and garlic, very finely minced. Yep, and next was to cook. And so I preheated my oil in my sufuria until it came to temperature. And then I added my beef slices. Then I spread them so that they were all in one single layer, each and every piece touching the sufuria surface to prevent them from steaming up. And then I let them sit like that. After about three to four minutes, I turned them over and cooked the beef for a further three minutes or so. And then I removed it from the heat. And in the same same oil, I added my onions, cooked them for about a minute. Added my curry powder, cooked it for a further one minute or so to get rid of its raw taste and aroma before adding my finely minced ginger and garlic mixture. Then proceeded to cook it for about a minute for them to release their very nice aroma. And then at this point, I added my carrots. I cooked the carrots for about two minutes or so until they just started softening up. Before adding my colored hohos, mixed them in. But then at this point, I discovered that the oil was not enough and added it because I didn't want a very dry stir fry. So after I mixed in the oil, I added my spinach. You can slice up your spinach if you so wish. You can also remove the stalks, but this does not bother me. So I only made sure that the spinach leaves were clean before using them. And so once the spinach leaves were well mixed in, I added salt and freshly cracked black pepper to taste. Mix everything in again and then I gave the spinach leaves about 3 minutes to wilt down completely before adding my beef and the spring onions. So at this point I mixed everything together and then gave the dish about 2 minutes for the beef to warm up. Before adding my leftover spaghetti. But I quickly realized that the spatula that I was using was not going to help me mix up everything properly. So I switched to my wooden nipple, which did the job perfectly. 
So after everything was mixed in properly, I gave the spaghetti about 3-4 minutes for it to really warm up because it was cold before adding light soy sauce and barbecue sauce. It's totally optional. I'm sure it sounds very strange to some people to have barbecue sauce in a stir fry. But I like the sweetness that it imparts to the dish. Try it out and thank me later because I'm sure you're going to love it. And that was it. My meal was done because after about a minute, I took it off the heat and served it. Here is my spaghetti stir fry, all ready done. I garnished it with a bit of spring onions and enjoyed my dish. So until next time, kwaheria kuonana, keep it jikoni magic, goodbye.